So on the inside of this warm, nondescript flour tortilla is gonna be the return of an iconic favorite over here at Taco Bell. And it's actually gonna be my very first time trying this. Guys, as you already know by the title to this one, it's the returning yet new for me, beefy crunch burrito over here at Taco Bell. So stay tuned because I've got it up next for you. I'm Ian Kay, and you're about to peep this out. Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian Kay. Stay frosty. Well, it feels like Taco Bell and it definitely smells like Taco Bell, but the appearance department, it's just a little bit different, guys. And that has a lot to do with the flaming Hot Fritos that you're gonna see right in here. And I gotta say, guys, it looks pretty decent still. Let me break this one on down for you before we get fully into it. All right, so is the hype real? We're about to find out, guys. The Beefy Crunch Burrito, consisting of a warm flour tortilla, and on the inside, you're gonna find a decent combination of seasoned beef, flaming Hot Fritos, seasoned rice, reduced fat sour cream, and nacho cheese sauce. So the only real new addition to this is gonna be those flaming Hot Fritos, so I'm expecting some crunch, guys, but the familiar flavors otherwise, I think this is gonna be pretty tasty just for what it is. So let's not waste any more time on this one. I definitely want to see if the flavor delivers. It's the new for me, returning beefy crunch burrito here at Taco Bell. Let's peep out this flavor. So I gotta say the hype is deafening at this point, guys. I mean, there was so much hoopla about the return of this online. I have to admit, guys, with the whole movement of beefy crunch burrito fans really clamoring to get this one back on the menu here at Taco Bell, they finally listened. It's finally here. You guys voted for it. I know I definitely voted for it because I want to try it and I can't wait to do just that. So without further ado, here we go. It's the returning, and again, brand new for me, Beefy Crunch Burrito here at Taco Bell. Let's peep this out. Crunchy. I love Fritos. Corn chip goodness with Taco Bell goodness. Mm. Well, I can definitely appreciate the heat the flaming Hot Action is bringing to the party here, guys. Hang on one second. Wow, very nice indeed. And considering it's over 105 outside of my car here right now, it's a little glutton for punishment going in on this. But guys, very familiar flavor. The real standout is easily gonna be the flaming Hot Fritos, guys. But again, very familiar with all the other ingredients, but it's definitely hearty, guys. And of course, quintessential Taco Bell goodness. Very tasty on this one. You know, on the real, I just keep thinking to myself, how many times have I done a review over here at Taco Bell and it's been these same ingredients with the exception of the promo ingredient? I mean, naturally the beef, the rice, the sour cream, naturally the reduced fat goodness, the cheese sauce, it's all gonna be the same, but with the flaming Hot Fritos, that is a nice little addition to add an even more corn crunch to this one on top of the flaming Hot goodness. So let's go for another bite and we're gonna go for a glutton for punishment with some hot sauce in a second. Hang on. Mmm. There's a lot of Fritos in here tasty. Well, I guess I can say I understand the hype on this particular one, guys. All of you Beefy Crunch Burrito fans have a lot to look forward to with this one because of the Frito action that this one has. It's noticeably different than, say, Cheetos or regular corn chips. This works very nicely with the flaming Hot Goodness. A beautiful situation. But of course, I guess it really wouldn't be Taco Bell without adding some form of hot sauce to it, right? So in this case, why not go for a glutton for punishment, Diablo, and done, which is about how I feel with the heat situation right now in Southern Cali, guys. I am totally sweating every single day for like the last two weeks now. I'm over it. So let's go for a little hot sauce on this action. And I'm going to pour a little bit right over here and we'll give this a shot. We'll see what Diablo adds to Flaming Hot on top of it. Let's give it a go. Extra sizzle, light sour cream trying to do its thing. That's actually really good, really good. And again, glutton for punishment, hang on. All right, not bad on this one, guys, not bad. For 269, a decent value for what you're gonna get here. It seems to be packed pretty nicely, but plenty of that flaming Hot action. So let's go for one more bite. We'll wrap this little quickie review with the rating coming up next. We'll add some more hot sauce for a glutton for punishment. But like I said, I can understand why you guys are digging this. All the fans that really wanted this back. And I guess now I'm considered part of the movement since I voted for it. I finally tried it and I'm glad that this is on the menu right now. I will be getting this again, guys. Pretty tasty. Let's go for one more bite and we'll wrap this one up. Hang on. Well, you can fade the iconic flavors over here at Taco Bell, guys, with the addition of flaming Hot Fritos to the mix, all wrapped up good to go in this warm tortilla. I have to say a lovely situation in terms of overall familiar flavor with added crunch on top of it. But at the end of the day, it's still Taco Bell with those familiar ingredients with the addition of flaming Hot Fritos. So as you're gonna see with the rating on the screen here right now, while I definitely dug it, I don't think it's really anything super special, but it's definitely something tasty to go in on. 
And of course, I think many of you guys are gonna do that. Like I said, the hype is real with this online right now, guys, and I can honestly understand why you want it back on the menu after so many years. It really does the job with a decent amount of those flaming Hot Fritos, so I totally get it. But again, guys, very, very familiar, but still very tasty, regardless of the weather that you may be having it in. In this case, I'm in hell right now. It's literally over 110 plus degrees. It feels like in my car. It is what it is. Definitely give this one a go, and if you've made it this far into the review, you're most likely gonna. All right, so do me a quick favor like always. Drop those comments down below. First and foremost, confirm the obvious for me, letting me know your love for the Beefy Crunch Burrito is real. And secondly, if you've had this new version of it now that it's back on the menu, did it taste any different to you? Do you remember it exactly like it was when you first tried it? Drop some comments down below and definitely let me know. And with that, this is Ian K closing out another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Out Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So I stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. Hey, thanks for checking out this review, guys. But just in case you didn't see the one I did before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's gonna recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya.